Hi, Sheila here. I'm going to talk you through a kinesiology treatment. I'm going to talk you through a kinesiology investigation. And I want you to see how my brain works and how kinesiology helps me to find clues. Picture this. I had a lady in and she was presenting with gut issues, recurring infections, low energy, gurgling, reflux, indigestion, heartburn, feeling stuck here, phlegm, nasal drip, and sinus. Okay, so during the muscle testing, figured out, haha, there was low stomach acid. Now there's only a few reasons why your brain would turn down your stomach acid. Number one, you could have an underlying helicobacter or also called H. pylori infection. Number two, you're very stressed and you're not eating properly and you're chewing your food too fast and you're not sitting down to relax to eat. Number three, your stomach acid production has dropped off due to zinc deficiency or some other mineral or vitamin deficiency. Or four, you have an underlying hiatal hernia. So upon investigation, bingo, yes, you did have a hiatal hernia. The hiatal hernia, uh, easily fixed with kinesiology and then Got the diaphragm nice and balanced because the diaphragm is the muscle separating our organs here, the lung and the heart, lungs and heart from the uh, slippery and slimy and acid filled, half digested food filled organs that are below the barrier. So when we have a hiatal hernia, what happens is a little bit of our stomach pops up like alien and the stomach is like, hey guys, what's happening? And the lungs and the heart are freaking out. Get out of here. You're disgusting. This is the penthouse. You shouldn't be here. So the brain has to send a message straight away to the stomach. Don't produce any acid in case some of it spills up and into the chest. Yeah. So fix that. No problem. Carry on with the investigation. So due to like April, April, May, June, July, August, September, like six months of low stomach acid and hiatal hernia, this lady's digestive system had gone phew, nosedive to the point where even eating was becoming stressful because when you're going to eat and you know you're going to have some sort of uh, indigestion or uncomfortable feelings later, it will put you off your food. That's normal. Pancreas energy was out as well because blood sugars were all off. Oh, it was like a detective novel. I love it. I love it. I love figuring out what's going on. Okay, moving down along, small intestine was completely out of balance, which means that the quadriceps weren't getting fed or healed. did no power. So I asked, do your legs get tired when you're walking long distance or walking up the stairs or climbing? Yeah, yeah. How do you know that? Well, because small intestine energy is low, which also means you're not making enough serotonin. Have you also let go of hobbies and things you used to love to do and now you don't do them anymore? Yes, yes, I used to love. I used to love sports. Uh, I used to love walking. I used to love doing arts and crafts and I just gave up on all of them. You didn't give up on them because you got bored or because you're not, and you don't love them anymore. You gave up on them because your brain had done an audit to see how much energy do I have today? And your brain came back with, you barely have enough energy to get through work. So don't go, don't be funny. Don't do anything funny. No funny stuff later. No hobbies or passions. The brain is like, we are on autopilot here. We are just getting what we need to get done, done and no more. So large intestine was also blocked because holding on to toxicity from the undigested, putrefying food in the gut. Oh, anyway, gave her a really good treatment plan. Gave her homework to do, points to rub, one, two supplements to take, but you can take them together. And other homework that's a little bit uh, more emotional and electrical. But the point is, that's what happened in the kinesiology treatment. It was like light bulb, light bulb, light bulb. It doesn't depend on me knowing what's wrong with you. Your body tells me everything. The muscles never lie. And we get all our information from the muscles. I hope you've enjoyed listening to me talking about this thing that I had to do yesterday. And I absolutely loved it. Uh, if you want a kinesiology treatment, just get in touch. I'm all over social media. Bye.